Hello together, in this video I want to show you how to make a software update on your iPhone 14. It is very important to make software updates regularly because they not only provide you with new features but they also close bugs and uh, it's good for your security and the performance of your iPhone 14. So you can see here I already have the one here because the settings want to tell me something. So I click on the settings and you can see here software update. It, it, this is German but it means software update this night. But it doesn't matter. So it, it gives me an information there is a software update that I can do. But sometimes, most of the cases, you won't see this. So just to check for yourself if there is so a software update, you go to the settings and then to general. And then when you are in, in general you click on software update. All right, so you can see here, there is uh, um, here iOS 16. This update is recommended for all iPhone 14, iPhone 14 Pro users. They um, iMessage and FaceTime may not complete activation and other bugs, all right? So then you click on install now, and then, all right, everything, this security update will try to, uh, to install later tonight, but I can also click on install now, and then, then it will install. Remember that you should have always 50% on battery to uh, on your um, iPhone uh, 14 so that the um, that you don't get any problems uh, the best would be if you would uh, just plug in um, here your cable so uh, it won't run out of battery but uh, the second thing i want to show you is the automatic updates and you can see your automatic updates on so it will automatically download ios updates it will automatically install ios updates automatically install software updates overnight after they have been downloaded you will receive a notification before updates and are installed your iphone must be charging and connected to wi-fi to complete the update and the second one is the first one is the ios updates and the second one is security responses and system files automatically install rapid security responses and system files for iphone and supported accessories you may need to restart your iphone to complete the installation some system files will always be installed automatically even if security response and system files is turned off. So even if you turn it off, Apple says it doesn't matter, we will install this. So I would recommend you to leave everything on and just to install your updates here regularly. So the settings, general and then software update. I hope this video helped you a little bit. If yes, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and we'll see us the next time. Bye bye.